what's up you guys and welcome back for more days gone part 35 uh i've been doing like a few intros uh for for the channel here i just been trying i just i'm not trying to just repeat myself over and over you know on every intro so just trying to mix it up here for for at least a few videos so again guys just thank you guys so much i can't believe how far we've gone to the series and uh i think feel like i don't know it just feel like now we just the longer i think the last time i have actually gone the series i think it was red dead so that was uh my longest series of the channel so but again guys just everything all the likes and support you guys have been putting this series just thank you guys so much for the time of watching this so but with that being said guys let's continue this um at the previous video it was just pretty much like a big big episode now we already know what happened to jesse or how i say just carlos um it's just like more of a boss fight, actually. So now that we already know what happened to Schizo, I don't know. I don't know if I would just call this anything, but not right now. It doesn't feel like it right now. So I just want to just wait for maybe I don't know how long this war series will last. Hey, I heard. You know, I mean, what you did for us, how you, the Rippers, all of them. I just, I know you had to do it. What else was gonna stop them? You know. Yeah, look, Blair, I'm not proud of what I had to do. You know that, right? I mean, it had... we had to... <laughs> look, they were coming. Yeah, yeah, I know. You don't have to explain anything to me. I was here when they attacked, remember? I... I don't know. I guess I'm just tired, you know? Yeah, I know. I'm gonna quit my rifle here. That's really great. Sam automatic rifle sniper rifle for taking precious shots for greater distance. Fill ammo, really? I'm gonna okay. purchase that one. Nice. Since I already got that one, let me just put a suppressor on that. I already have it. Okay. Uh, yep. Check this out here. I love putting the suppressor on. So nice. Got all that. So again, guys, thank you, and let's do this. No, this is your clutch. I know where the clutch is. Right, do you want me to show you how to do this or not? Yes, but I know where the clutch is. Okay, fine. All right, you do it yourself, okay? Fine. Hey, hey, hey! What are you doing? You can't park here. Uh, I'm just here to pick it's up private Sarah property. Wh now turn around, get the hell out of here. Come on. Okay. <laughs> Move it. Yep. Uh, uh, okay, uh, you know what, though? I think I'm just gonna wait right here. You can go back to doing your guard the cornfields thing. This is Officer Moore at the gate. We got an issue here. <laughs> hey, listen, asshole. This is a restricted area. I told you, get the hell out of here. Hey, hey, you just wait right there. I told you. Move it. It's like I was trying to say. I'm just here you to pick up... Did you not see that sign? Oh, look at that. That's kind of hard to miss. I'm authorized to use deadly force. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Hey, 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 whoa, 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 what's going on? <laughs> I'm sorry, Miss Whitaker. It's, it's what, fine, I, Do you know this asshole? Yeah, he's with me. He's with me. Sorry, ma'am. I, I didn't on, know go. that... It's fine. Honestly, I apologize. Shh. Oh, and Jim! Deacon. I'm not with her. She's with me. Hold on tight. Why do you always do that? Do what? Act like such a dick. Oh, come on. He started it. What are you, five? Hey, watch the clutch. Remember, you gotta give it enough gas, rev up the RPMs. I got this. Yeah, I've been here. Where are we headed? Over to the dam. That's a nice, quiet road, right? Are you driving? No. Are we still going out tonight? You said something might come up. Uh, crap, yeah. Uh, Boozer and the boys want to ride down to Clam Estate to visit Jack. So you're going to blow me off to go see some guy in prison? Jack's not some guy. I know, I know. I was kidding. Oh! 
You, some idiot in a truck tries to run us off the road. Oh my god, no, 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 listen, 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 you did great, you did great. Uh, most people, they would have panicked, they would have oversteered, and that would have gotten us killed. I almost did get us killed. I was, <sighs> no, no. I wasn't paying attention, and I was distracted. Hey, it's okay, it's okay. Just breathe, you're okay. Wait a second, what did, what did you mean, distracted? No, it's just stuff going on at work, it's nothing, I just... Oh. Okay, no, I just thought maybe you uh, saw my new patch. You what? No. No, Matt? Wait, you, you quit the club? No, I didn't quit the club. I would never quit the club. Uh, uh, nomad, what it means is, um, well, I'll be less involved from now on. Deke, I didn't ask you to do that. Oh, I know, I know. And if you had, I would have said no. <laughs> you ready to try this again? Yeah, I mean, no, but yeah, I will. Thank you for saving my life. <laughs> well, you know, I do what I can. Hey, hey, the clutch, the clutch. I know what the clutch is. Okay, no, no, the... Deacon. So, uh, do you think your parents are gonna come? To the wedding? I don't know. I mean, you know, I, I thought if I stepped back from the MC that, uh... I don't think it's gonna matter to them, Deacon. But you're gonna, you're gonna at least tell them. Yeah, if you want me to. Look, it's just... I'm not going to change who I am and who you are to make my uptight, middle-class parents happy. Okay. Look out. I see them. Hey, are they, are they headed to your work? Oh, shit. What about the MC? Are any of them coming now that you've got Nomad? Oh, uh, I don't know. Uh... It's probably been a while since any of them set foot in a chapel, uh, and you really want 27 Harleys rolling up in that little church in Marion Forks? Yeah. You know what? As a matter of fact, I do. Uh, okay. What's going on? Uh, I don't know. Miss Whitaker. Yeah. She's been trying to get a hold of you, says it's urgent. <laughs> it's always urgent. Let him know I'll be right there. Okay. I gotta go. Hey, hey. <laughs> Sorry. It's fine. It's probably just a fire alarm or something small. Okay. How come death? <clears throat> Love you. Um, just call me later. I'm sorry. Whatever. Addy, whatever, Ricky. I'm sorry. Clearance. Clearance. Uh, O'Brien, this is St. John. Come back. O'Brien, this is St. Just answer your goddamn radio! St. John, didn't think I'd hear from you again. Yeah, neither did I. All right, listen, that night you bugged out. You told me that you didn't take any civilians. You just took uh, Nero personnel, feds, people with clearance. I told you there shut was up, shut up, do. shut up. Listen to me. Sarah, my wife, she had clearance. She had her ID badge with her the night that I put her on your chopper. So just do me a favor, look it up. Sarah Irene Whitaker. She worked at Cloverdale. She had federal clearance. She was doing, uh, I don't know, research pharmaceutical. I don't know what she, the hell she was okay, doing. Just okay. do me. I'll see what I can find. Okay, great. O'Brien, remember, you owe me. Yeah, yeah. O'Brien out. Hundred percent mission completed. Seventy percent. I did not think we would be going to that flashback again. All right, new skill point. I'm gonna check it out here because I did. Um, I didn't. I wasn't recording at the time, but I did. Did a new skill point for this one. Um, I like this one a lot. Headshot kills recovery health. I really wanted just to try this. 
which I already did. So, so more the more headshots I did, the more health I get. So even though I'm I'm on low health, the more shots I receive, I mean, blow like walkers or freakers or you know or rippers or any of that matter, I do gain health. That's pretty awesome though. I really want to just keep that one. It's a good thing I got it or I increased the range of survival vision. Oh uh, man, I really want to just let me look more survival. All right, what's this right there? Increase. Range weapons, increase ammo capacity for all. Oh man, these are all so, so good. I don't even know. Under pressure, reduces the reload time times to range weapons. Increase ammo. You know what? Oh man, I really want to just increase ammo. It just like I do ran into some ammo real quick, so I really just want to just gain more. So why not? All right. How does it work? All right. Let's see a mission pops out or something, so that has to be though. Or uh, I'm not quite sure it will or Hmm. It's weird from the from this one, it doesn't even pop up or something. Hey Blair, how are things in the gun trade? Got the crow bra crow breaker. I've got that already, so I just wish we could have more of these. You know I have to like regain more. Pistol ammo, yeah, of course. Good. Yep. I'll probably just do the the Ricky. Hold up, what is this right there? Inventory, gear up. Yeah, okay. Pretty much just just inventory stuff. Yeah, okay. The only mission that we have right now is just Ricky's mission, so I'll probably take a look at it right now. So why not? Yeah, that's pretty insane. though what happened? I'm pretty sure I have to wait for it, but for now. I do Ricky's mission. Two dogs back. What? Where? Where the hell is he? He took off when he saw me. Jeremy followed him. I I know. I tried to stop him. Jesus, where, Ricky? Jeremy tracked him to the old sawmill, said two dog looked like he was holed up in the abandoned Nero camp. Okay, I'll take care of him. I need you to bring back his knife. <laughs> Wait, you need proof? Jesus. All right. Fine, great, whatever you say. Don't let him get away, Deke. Who knows how many bodies are buried out there? Yeah, I got this. Oh, I just auto saved by myself. It's funny because I was gonna quick save it too. <laughs> All right. All right. Nice. Quick save it. That's awesome. Going through the gate, boys. That'd be awesome if that gate just opened up automatically. How awesome would that be? Hey John, this is oh, hold on, this is O'Brien. O'Brien, what do you got? I need to see you in person. Jesus, O'Brien, just would you tell me what you found is ish? Is she alive or isn't she? I have something to give you. O'Brien. I've transmitted the coordinates. Really? Right now. O'Brien. Booze man, listen, just uh, tell him I'll be back. I gotta. You remember what I told you? Um, the night that Sarah died, Nero, they bugged out. They only took their own people, fans, people who had federal clearance levels. Damn, what the hell are you talking about? Look, it's probably nothing, but there's something I gotta do. Deacon out. All right. See if the mission pops out or not. Um, that's to be though, right? Or I return to camp. Not this one though. Yeah. How many bodies? Wait, is it this one though? Iron Mike's. Y'all, how far am I though? I probably take the narrow mission later on because it's not showing it here. That's weird. Oh, hold up. Oh, all the way over there. Oh, no, never mind. This is not it. So, <laughs> I thought it was. Okay, so. Turn to Cooper's camp. I think, yeah, this one has to be it. So, Iron Mike's. I'll probably just go there for now. All right, new mission. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah, Deacon. You know, you're a good friend to him. He's lucky to have you. Information. What information, O'Brien? 
the hell can you possibly have left to say that I would give a damn about? Dick, you there? Yeah, yeah booze man, what's up? I just, I just wanted to say thanks for the dog. It's no worries, brother. I mean, it, it followed me, you know? Wouldn't leave me alone. What was I supposed to do? Hey, hey, get down. Hey. <laughs> Easy. Yeah, sure it followed you. Hey, uh, I named him Jack. <laughs> yeah, Jack would have loved that. Uh, no, he wouldn't have, which is why I did it. <laughs> all right, easy, easy, boy. All right, all right, enough, enough. Okay, Dick, I gotta go. Boozer out. I wanna check here. Oh, this is the main mission. Okay, I wanna take a look at this real quick. You're welcome. I'm going all the way around here, guys. I still made a radio contact going on today. I just wanna just skip ahead with the side quest, though. And just go with the actual main thing. St. John, this is Lost Lake. Come in. What I tell you? Yeah, Mike. This is Dick. I heard you tracked down Harp. I was hoping you'd bring him in for trial. Well, sorry, Mike. He uh, let, let's say the swarmers had other ideas about that. Oh shit! Ricky didn't tell me that. Harp wasn't the kind of man you ever turned your back to, but he didn't deserve to go out like that. Ah, uh, I guess not. Uh, but then I guess Dan Lane didn't deserve to get shot in the back either. Oh shoot, watch out man. It's a good thing I increased the upgrade for this. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. The war on terror. Global warming. None of that matters now that we're in the shit. But it's all just part of the goddamn conspiracy. Oh, I gotta slow down here. to recruit a few guys who I trust, like me, aren't happy with what's going on. So why am I here? I wanted to give you this. You were right. About your wife. Where did you get this? When Silver Lake evacuated, they took Nero personnel, federal officials, and well, Sarah Irene Whitaker had a class 4 federal clearance level. Clearance level. The wife bugged out with a recon unit, east of Fort Rock. Take me there. No. No. Well, you got a ride. We're all friends now. The base is gone. What? A year ago. Local militia group. Militia group? Where's their camp? We don't know. How the hell can you not know? You got a helicopter. You got satellites. Somewhere around Crater Lake, but it's a no-fly zone, okay? They got outposts, rockets, RPGs. Crater Lake. Crater Lake. Oh, I wanted to tell you about the work we're doing. Studying the infected, the freaks. They're evolving. As bad as things are right now, they're gonna get worse. A lot worse. Oh, wow. <laughs> I don't even know what to think of that. 74%? We're almost to 100 on this one. All right. Riding Nomen again. Drive to location. It's a good thing I got my bike here so I can actually just... Right. Quick save it. About any of that. Boozer. Booze man, come back. Yeah, Dean. Hey, listen, listen to me. Uh, a year ago, we were with Iron Mike. We were thinking about riding south. But the Santium Pass was blocked, there was no way through, and he said that he knew another way. Dude, Iron Mike, he's, he's not too happy with us right now. Well, just listen to me, just listen to me. Do you remember what he said? Iron Mike? Yeah, he was, he was 
bragging about knowing every goat trail in 100 miles. So there was a, a trail that went around Mount Thiels. Thiels, I don't know, something. Thielsen! Thielsen, yeah, that's it. Thielsen Pass. Yeah, well, why the hell you... Wait, you... Shit. You... You've talked to... She's alive? Sarah's alive? Deke? Okay, listen to me. O'Brien, they, uh... Boozer, he found her ID badge. Yeah, Boozer, uh... I, I think that she's alive. Deke. You never lost hope. You always knew. You never gave up. So what are you gonna do? I don't know, Boozer. I don't know, uh, but... Oh my God, if there's even a chance that she's alive, I... Well... I gotta find her. Goddamn right. Uh, shit, I, I gotta go. Uh, Ricky and Andy need, need help putting up a shelf or some goddamn thing. Look, I, I'll see you when you get back to camp. Boozer out. Alright guys, as always, thank you guys so much for watching this, take care.